I'm James. I'm Tom. I'm Matt. And I'm Charlie. And we're the Stiff Dillons. With a bit of luck, we're going to teach you ultraviolet. Intro, two chords. What are they? <laughs> well, you don't really need to know chords to get by life. I know number one, fret one. And whilst he's doing that, uh, the lead part comes in on number one as well. And then you play a D and a B. You're using the you need yeah, to yeah, number. Yeah, I'm using that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. If you're going to record it, it's probably pretty nice to get it sounding a bit warmer. Get rid of a bit of the distortion, it will sound a lot cleaner and it'll bring it out a bit more. Hiya, um, I'm Tom from the Stiff Dillons and uh, I'll be showing you how I play the drums on Ultraviolet. The way I was told to do it when I was like first learning it, my sister did piano and everything, so she had these two rhythms going on and she taught me nice cup of tea, which is basically nice cup of tea, nice cup of tea. The bass drum pattern, that came out for the sticks so you can you know, know where I am in the bar. Uh, the pattern goes like, With your right hand on the right cymbal, you play it with the shoulder of the stick there on the flat part of the cymbal. So I'll show you that in context. I'm Matt, I uh, play bass in the Stiff Dillons. You start on E flat major. For beginners, detuning between E and E flat is just a semitone, which means one fret. So if that was, if that was an E, then to detune down one semitone would be just tuning down to that. Mute with your right hand fingers by when you play the note, move your finger through the string and then put your other finger onto the string to stop it. Practice things like you get good and then you get fast. One, two, three, four. Hi, we're the Stiff Dillons and if you come to nowplayit.com you can see us teach you how to play ultraviolet. True.